Hi guys and ladies. You know my friend Wendy pointed out this YouTube recipe for me. It's from the channel You Can Cook. There are two reasons I love this recipe. First, it uses fish and I have lots of fish in the freezer. Second, it's low carb. Now that wasn't intentional, but some recipes just turn out that way. So let's see if we can even do this. Here I have one pound and a half of bluegill and small bass fillets from my pond fishing adventures. The Mexican lady in the video used six fillets of a much larger fish, maybe tilapia or cod even. So it'll be interesting to see if I can convert this to small panfish. I'm just adding a little salt and pepper to both sides of these fillets. So now I'm washing eight ounces of spinach leaves fresh from my garden. Not really. The supermarket. I'm not a spinach guy, so I don't know what to do. The lady in the video steamed the spinach in a pot like this for five minutes. I don't know what temperature, so I'll put this on medium. I'm nervous. Here goes. Five minutes now. If this spinach doesn't come out like spinach, then we're... <laughs> then the video is being called off. Well, here goes. It looks spinachy. I think it worked. <laughs> now that I've cooked it and I get the aroma, I realize it's not that delightful. And now I remember why I never liked it as a kid. Don't touch that dial though. Things are going to get better. I'm going to let this cool so that then I can wring out every bit of water from it. Popeye would be so proud of me now. Now I have to finally chop the spinach. This is not my favorite vegetable. The lady in the video used three quarters cup of what she called cream. Well, it was thicker than heavy whipping cream, but thinner than sour cream. I could only conclude that she used Mexican crema, since she's Mexican and she does do a Spanish version of the recipe. So what I'm going to do is thin this sour cream with some heavy whipping cream to replicate the consistency of crema. So I'm going to start with one part heavy whipping cream and then add to that two parts of sour cream. This is crazy, I know. It seems to work. That's about where we want it, I hope. So I'm going to put this cream, crema, in a uh, large mixing bowl. And to that mixing bowl, I'm putting our chopped, cooked spinach. Now, just a little salt and pepper. Now the Mexican lady added a cheese called manchego from Spain and uh, she used about a cup. So here goes marble jack instead. The key here is that the cheese has to melt. Oh, baby, it's coming together. So let's set our oven to 300 degrees. That sounds kind of low, but that's what our lady did. 
Well, here's today's production line idea. We're going to take the fillets, we're going to put them in the dish. I'm going to add the filling, roll them up, put toothpicks in them, and finally put them in the casserole dish. What I'm going to do now is try spreading a remaining mixture over the top of all of our stuffed fish fillets. Well, here it goes in the oven for 15 minutes. While our fish is in the oven, I might as well let you know that I'm a bit nervous because that beautiful celebrity food critic, Miss Lulu Cheeks, has accepted my invitation to dinner tonight. If I can please her enough with this dish, I'll bet anything that tonight she finally utters words of love in my ear. It's been 15 minutes. Time to get out the casserole. hope they're cooked. So the fillets look just a little bit shiny and to me that means they could be cooked more. I'm gonna put them in for maybe a whole nother seven minutes or so. Well ready or not they're coming out. I think that looks better. That looks actually good. They smell good. In Spanish, these are called rollitos de pescado a la crema, and that's very hard to translate into anything meaningful in English. Maybe in English you could say fish with cream a la Popeye. Well, here we are again with that famous celebrity food critic, Miss Lulu Cheeks. Thanks for coming, Miss Cheeks. Well, I can call you Lulu now? Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Hey, uh, I have some fish with uh, cream, a la Popeye. Would you like to try a sure. little bit? Yes. All right. Mmm, good. You like it? Mm hmm Oh, great, great, great. You, uh, you know, Miss Cheeks, you like a lot of things. Uh, like, for example, what do you think of cream cheese? I love cream cheese. Mmm. What about pizza? Oh, I love pizza. Mmm. Uh, what's your opinion of oh, peppermint candy? I love peppermint candy. What do you think of Juanello? Oh, I love his humor. Oh, well, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, that's something. Mm -hmm. Since she is Mexican and she does a Spanish... Uh, it's, uh, let's start again. <laughs>